should be already, by the time you're listening to this episode, you should know that we're desperate for sponsors. Not desperate, but we're looking. We are interviewing sponsors. You know, right now, Coca-Cola called last week, didn't they? No. They didn't call? No. No? No. Fuck, I swear they would have called. Kool-Aid. You think Kool-Aid will call? I'm the the perfect Kool-Aid guy, man. I'm shaped just like your Kool-Aid guy. And I'm willing to run through drywall. Because it well, seems like fun. It well, seems maybe, like a lot of fun. Maybe now they'll call. Let's go. Kool-Aid. We're willing to sponsor. You know? And then we also, if we get you Kool-Aid, we also need to get sponsored by like Red Pass or something. Like the fucking sugar company. Or um, what's, the, what's the other one? I don't know. Sugar. Anything that makes, <laughs> anybody who makes sugar. Sugar. Any you, sugar products. You, I don't believe you can drink Kool-Aid <laughs> without well, 18 pounds of sugar. True. Yeah. True. You know I mean, they should sell them right beside each other. The the the, the Kool Aid should be sold right, right beside, beside the sugar. Yeah. Thing. In they the thing. that's be. marketing. That's see, that's how you sell shit. You ever drink sugar water? Yeah. The sugar sugar water was a thing, man. When I was when, growing up, when you didn't have Kool Aid guy. Yeah, you just put sugar in the fucking water and just stir <laughs> that shit up. <laughs> yep. When your kids. What are you drinking? Sugar water. Sugar water. <laughs> government juice. <laughs> government juice. <laughs> Some government cheese. Yep. Oh my God! I remember. Doing all that shit because we didn't, for a little while when we were growing up, we didn't have a lot. You know, like there were ups and downs. Oh yeah. And there were times me. when we didn't have a lot, so there were definitely times when you, you just got to put a little bit of sugar in the water. Trust me. Although it was Kool Aid was always there. The reason why Kool Aid was always there is because it was like five cents a, a packet, pack. and it made a whole jug. Dude, it was you like know? that tiny little packet said yeah, man. two liters on it. Exactly. Like, the, the package was no bigger than my palm, probably. And it was like. Not even a teaspoon of dust in there. No, I know. You just like that's how, you know, that's how much shit was probably packed in um, chemicals and whatever yeah, was packed into that. With some good chemical. Yo, the chemicals were delicious as long as you added the sugar. You know, because yeah, that exactly. shit did not taste like cherry. No, <laughs> until red you, water. Yeah, exactly. It just made it. <laughs> it just made it red and bitter somehow. You know, stain up your clothes. Yep. And then, uh, then you add eighteen pounds of sugar, and all of a sudden, it miraculous, miraculously, in English. Tastes like cherry. Is a thing. You know, we've gone on and on about Kool Aid this segment. I love Kool Aid. Yeah, <laughs> that's a but fuck, I love it too. Yo, I used to drink a lot of what's the orange one? Oh, Tang. Tang. That's it. Tang. tang. I used to drink Tang too, buddy. We used to. I love Tang. I still love the taste of Tang. I when when uh yes, when I was yes, like nostalgic yes. for me. Yo. You know, I could never drink Kool Aid again and whatever. But when I drink t- or when I drink Kool Aid, I'm like, oh, okay, whatever. I remember that. But yeah. Tang. Tang has this, I don't know, have this deep connection with Tang. I don't know yeah, what it is. Me. Yeah, I know. I feel it all in this area. Yeah. You know? The Tang flavor in my mouth. Sunny D, you ever drink Sunny yeah, D? Yeah, of course, Sunny D. I but it, Sunny, Sunny D. D was like, it was thick. Yeah. It was like a meal. But Sunny D, you didn't have to mix together, too. Like, Sunny D was well, like... you a, had to dilute. So. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. <laughs> or else you'd be chewing. <laughs> Yo, Sunny what do you D. Mean? Sunny D. Sunny D chewing gum. <laughs> it was like, you could blow bubbles with Sunny oh, D. Oh, trust me. Yeah. You know? That stuff could, uh, you could hurt somebody with that. <laughs> yeah. Just dash a cup of Sunny Yo, D. Yo, if you ever spill Sunny D, it turned into the blob. It would just, yeah, it just, it'd just get, it'd just multiply and get bigger and bigger. It'd go back to the bottle. I need yeah. to go back home. Exactly. Kind of like the Venom, like the yeah. Venom oh, symbiote running all over the place. Oh, trust it, me. It, what is that? Sunny D. <laughs> <laughs> I just spilled a, I spilled a half bottle of Sunny D. Sorry, man. You know? Sunny D is running, only... running loose down Young Street yeah, right trust now. Me. It's the only thing that you can spill. And it, don't worry about the three second rule. Oh, so he, oh, okay. Hold on a second. Let me get my cup. Yeah. It just jumps back into your glass. <laughs> <laughs> you know? And then it looks at you. Spilly talker. Yeah, yeah. Spilly talker. And, then, and it whips the dust from the ground up back out of you. you know? it, yeah. Pick up the hair off the ground and just yell. Sweep your fucking floor. <laughs> Yo, my Sunny D just yelled at me to sweep, man. Yeah, trust me. Oh, my God. Okay. Who's better? Oh, the here we Chris go. Harrison again. Yep. I got a good one for you. Yeah. Deion Sanders. 